Hey, what's going on you guys? It's Shadow here bringing you guys a brand new video. I know it's been about six months since I've actually said that phrase, but I can explain. Um, just COVID and everything's been a lot. My dad went through a big surgery and everything, and I just took a big break off of YouTube. But I'm back, and I'm here to stay. I'm going to be making the best content for you guys that I possibly can. So, in today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys everything you need to know about the new Fortnite Tilted update. Um, if you guys do enjoy the video, please make sure to smash a like on it. And please make sure to subscribe to the channel. I know that I was pretty bad at keeping my promises of staying here, but I'm, now I'm here to stay. So, the first thing that they've actually added in this update is... Tilted Towers, obviously, so they added the exact same Tilted Towers that was in the Chapter 1 map, but after a thousand days, you'd expect a couple little new changes, so I'm going to be going over those. So the first thing they changed, they actually made a place called Pizza Pit, with a guy named Tomato Head NPC, you can buy a Blue Hunter Bolt Action, and you can buy a Rift, and even a prop disguised by them. The next place is they switched the basketball court to a soccer court, and they added a new guy you can talk to here new npc so you can buy a legendary stinger smg which is a very good start here's just a fun little clip that i got of a tornado hitting tilted towers i thought it was pretty cool for the video um since tornadoes it's also pretty new it came out about a week and a half ago so that was a pretty new as well so i'm gonna let you guys enjoy this clip for a minute Now, I hope you guys did enjoy that clip of the Tornado and Tilted, but the next clip here is going to be with Colombo, which is a new dinosaur type thing. This is him charging, and then this is what you can do. You can go on to him, and then you can use that like a little hole to actually make him shoot you up. Another thing you can do is feed him berries, and he'll suck in like that, and he'll drop you loot. So like right here, I got a purple auto shotgun and a legendary ranger assault rifle. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And as you can see, you climb up by jumping on his tail like so. When he gets mad, he charges at you pretty badly. He chases you around. He tries. He, he throws like these grenade bomb things at you, which is also pretty cool. I personally love them. I love the concept. I love the idea. Let's just hope they don't ruin him and make him annoying like they usually do with things like these. But anyways... So the last thing that I know that they've added is the grenade launchers. As you can see, here's a couple of clips of me getting kills and getting damage with them. Um, I only got a couple. I only got it a couple times, so I don't really know. It's pretty good. I find that the grenades take a lot longer to explode, which is easier to kill the enemies. So that's one good thing. But yeah, so that's that's like the last thing that I really recognize that they've added in this update. If there's any more things, I'll add it in the comment section or in the description down below. But I'm pretty sure this is all they've really added that are really big changes in this update. So this is my video back. I hope you guys do enjoy it. Um, I hope you guys stick around for future videos because I'm going to be uploading at least weekly. I don't want to make too big promises quite yet, like daily or every other day. I'm just going to say once a week for right now, and then if anything changes, I'll let you guys know in future videos. Hope you guys did enjoy it, and without further ado, it's been It's Shadow, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.